going on? Hello, Doris. Oh, I'm fine, love. Well, you're looking better. You put your weight on again. I brought you some eggs and jam. That's fine. Well, what did the doctor say, Jack? He said I could go home in a few days, but I wouldn't be able to work for some time, lass. What did he say about your eyes? Well, it's early yet. He thinks I might be able to see again if I have special treatment. Well, I'll have to do something. I'd best go back to the mill again. No, I don't like that. It was bad enough when he worked before. Don't talk silly, Jack. We've got to get money from somewhere. Well, let Kenneth go out to work. It's high time he left school. I could earn more than Kenneth. And besides, I don't want him to leave school anyway. I'm not having you going back to mill for anybody. I just think you're being stupid. I don't care. I won't have you going back to mill. Well, we'll see to that. I don't know of. Doris, would you be on that set, didn't she? That's right. One of the best wavers in Lancashire. She'd been left just some time now. Aye, must have been since her husband's accident. Have you heard anything about him lately? I've not, Percy. My husband did say there was no chance of him ever working again. We're a bit of bad luck that took her away from us. to see how you're going on. Oh, I'm fine, thanks. Come in, then. Still, it's nice for your husband having a garden, isn't it? Yes, but it's not like going to work. And it seems funny the two of us being home all day long. You'll have to come back to it, Mill, again. Your old looms are as good as ever. Percy sees to that. Yes, it's a long time since me and you worked together at St. Molly, isn't it? And if it wasn't for Jack, I'd be back at Mill tomorrow. Why should Jack object? He ought to be glad you're able to get a job. He's so touchy now he can't work. Doesn't like thoughts of me being the only wage journey. And then there's Kenneth. You mean Kenneth's still at school? Yes, that's the trouble. He's nearly 16 now, and his father thinks he ought to leave and get a job. But I want him to stay and get a scholarship. I see. He'd rather the lad be working than you. Well, I can understand how he feels, and I reckon you're up against it one way or another. But I'd tackle him again if I were you. It wouldn't be the first time if I did. There's no harm in trying. I'll talk to him right now. I should. And I must be going. I've got my husband's tea. Get ready. Right, do Cheerio, then. Now, don't forget, have another go at him. I'm glad you've come, Doris. I can't find my string. Here it is. It's out here. Who do you think has just been to see me, Jack? I don't know, love. It was Edna that I used to work with. You remember Edna? Oh, yes. How's she going on? She's doing fine. She still works, you know. I don't know how some folk manage it, burning the candle at both ends. Oh, don't be silly, Jack. The way you talk, you make it sound hard work. I suppose Edna's been putting ideas into your head now. Well, it would help us out. We've settled all this before. I won't have my wife slaving for anybody. Slaving, there's no one with mills nowadays. If anyone's got to work in this house, it's Kenneth. I could earn twice as much as he could. According to Edna. You leave Edna out of this. I'd enjoy a spell at my old trade if you'd be reasonable. Me be reasonable? What do you mean? You could look at it from my point of view. Do you think it's easy running a home for three of us on a pension? I suppose you think I'm going to stay at home and run the house? Well, something like that would only be fair. I'd look well pegging the clothes out, wouldn't I? 
The neighbours wouldn't half laugh. They get used to it. And what sort of mess do you think I'd make of a hot pot? I could give you lessons. Well, do what you like. But if it gets you down, don't blame me. Expecting me to make hot pot. Here's one of your old weavers back again, Percy. Well, wonders never cease. So let's come a looking at the old balls again, Aston. Looking at them, Percy. I've come a Jane and team again. Jane and team? They're coming back again on the old looms. Aye, they'll have me. Have they, lass? Have they? Why, they're just welcome as far as you may. I bet the husband were right glad they were coming back. Well, no, not exactly. Don't they worry, lass. He'll come to his senses when he sees the wage packet. <laughs> Settled all this before. I won't have my wife slaving for anybody. I suppose you think I'm going to stay at home and run the house. And what sort of mess do you think I'd make of a hot pot? Well, do as you like. What's up, Doris? Thinking about Ralph to come? me to make hot pot. You like it, Doris? It's lovely, Jack. I couldn't have done better myself. I knew we'd make a go of it. I think you'd better try the hot pot first. Oh, go on. The next thing you'll be giving me lessons. That'll be the day. 